Hi, I'm Tricia, a California organic gardener, and I hate to pull weeds. So I'm here to give you my tips on how to easily control your weeds organically. This garden bed doesn't have any weeds in it, and that's the way I want to keep it. I'm going to work this down-to-earth brand corn weed blocker into the soil. It's derived from corn gluten meal. As the label says, corn weed blocker is a pre-emergent weed suppressant that inhibits weed seeds from germinating in established lawns, vegetable gardens, and flower beds. And it doubles as a slow-release fertilizer due to its high nitrogen content. Mulching is a fantastic way to prevent your weeds from sprouting. This red mulching film, which I'm laying down, is really good for strawberries and tomatoes because it boosts their productivity. Fabrics, films, and papers deny the, the weeds light and increase the soil temperature. Biodegradable mulches like bark, straw, and grass are great for your ornamental garden. The coarser the material, the deeper the mulch should be. For a fine material like straw, it should be about three inches deep. For mulching material like bark, it should be about six inches deep. Mulching materials will keep the soil cool and they shouldn't be placed too close to the trunk of a tree. What do you do if you already have weeds? Weed flaming is a great alternative to chemicals for killing your weeds. And this is really the easy and fun way to weed. It has a little squeeze valve which helps control the flame. Make sure you have a hose or some water handy, just in case. And what happens is the flame heats the plant to the point where the cells burst. There are also organic herbicides whose main active ingredient is either clove oil or vinegar or citric acid. They can be used on broadleaf weeds as well as grasses and they usually smell like cinnamon or lemon. You want to read the label carefully, but generally speaking, you can spray organic herbicides on weeds that are less than six inches tall on a warm sunny day and make sure that you get full coverage. These herbicides are non-selective and non-systemic, so be sure and spray when there is no wind. The last method of weeding is the mechanical method, and this is the Fiskars Uproot Weeder. This lets me weed bigger weeds without bending or kneeling. It grips the weed so that it can easily be deposited in a bucket or wheelbarrow. And I take it back. I think this is more fun and easy than the flamer. Well, I hope my organic weeding tips will help you enjoy your garden a little bit more this season. So thanks for joining and grow organic for life.